Hey guys and welcome to the tech side. Today I'm going to be showing you how to downgrade iOS 11 back to iOS 10.3.2 without losing any of your data. So as you can see here I have my iPad on iOS 11 and I'm going to be downgrading that to iOS 10.3.2. All right, so now we're going to need to plug in our device to our computer and open up iTunes. Click on your device and make sure that it's connected. Next, open up your web browser and type in this URL. Then click iPhone, iPod, iPad, and Apple TV firmware. Here we're going to choose iOS 10.3.2 for our device from the drop down menu and click on download. Now we're just going to need to wait for that to download. After that file is downloaded we're going to go back into iTunes. Now this next step depends on what computer you're on. If you're on Mac, you're going to hold down the Option key and then click Check for Update. If you're on Windows, you're going to hold down the Shift key and then press Click for Update. I'm on Mac, so I'm going to hold down the Option key and then press Check for Update. Now we're going to locate the file that we just downloaded. Then press Open, and then press Update. Now once this is done, we're going to be back on iOS 10.3.2 with all of our data. If your computer asks you if you wanted to access information on your device, just press continue. Alright, now our device is restarted and we can just go ahead and open it up. And there you go guys, that's how you downgrade from iOS 11 to iOS 10.3.2. It's honestly really easy and you even get to save the wallpaper from iOS 11 if you chose that before you downgraded. Thanks for watching guys, if this helped you out make sure to give this a like and definitely share with your friends who also want to downgrade from iOS 11 back to iOS 10.3.2. If you guys get the chance please do check out my channel, it really helps a lot. Anyways, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you later.